on Friday, I put up a video. It's Obama, this one here, and I put up uh, the, the two ferns, the story of President Obama on Funny or Die. And one I put up was the news. This came out of Canadian. It was Canadian CTV News. CBC News and they did a really big story on Funny or Die and I just thought well gee I'm always putting up the news it's just another news story I put up the news for instance the Groundhog News has been up there since 2007 uh, 2006 sorry the Groundhog News has been up since 2006 one of the oldest channels all in years 189 videos I showed you the cop the copy strike this is what I did I wrote this letter this is the person here right there CS single this guy this is the guy that from uh, Funny or Die playing against me. And uh, I don't think he even knows what he's complaining about. The news is fair use. The reason I'm doing this video is because have six years or seven years or five years or three years or two years of work in YouTube, I would suggest that you back everything you've got. Because apparently anybody can make a claim against you. If, it's, if they think that they want to make a claim against you. So anybody that doesn't like you on YouTube, apparently the new rules are you can get pecked off. It's like, remember when we all first came to YouTube and it wasn't like this. And I'm going to, right now I'm going to send this, you see what I'm sending. I'm just going to send this copy right now. It's gone. I just sent it. Um, this was the SOS channel. This channel just go. I just put up news. It's just like shareware. News is shareware. Uh, for anybody who doesn't really know this, that you can put up the news. If you upload it, I just want people to know you do not make a lot of money on YouTube unless you're willing to work six or seven hours a day, like a full time job, and work at this place and really work it. That's the only way you can make money at it. Because really, you you go talk to most people. Are any of you guys making money? No, you're not making money because it's just a way to get control of our stuff. My experience of YouTube was really awesome. I love the people. It isn't the damn place, YouTube itself. It's the people that's in here I like. Look at the, look at the hits this thing was getting. That's only one day. You know, it, it just shows you that people don't like it when you do well here. And they, and it's got some, because see what happened, where it's the news, and I don't sell the news. I put it up on Remix. It's shareware. And, I, and what happened? I put it up on that channel, SOS. Okay, here's what happened. This is Groundhogs. Um, this is a very, 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 very old channel. And it was my late friend's. He passed away this March. And it meant a lot. Here's my Groundhog news. This was the Groundhogs with the S, as you can see. And it's had 2,137 200, subscribers. Look, it's gone. It's like... I can't get an answer. No, it says you can't. You have been permanently disabled, and no one, no one to talk to. Nobody. You can't talk to anybody. They don't. It's like they wanted that network down. And I asked people if you knew the Groundhogs movement, or you knew, or if you knew the Groundhogs, and you wanted, you know, you were sub to us. Please sub back. Okay, for anybody that knew us, this is the People Stand Up. As you can see, it's been suspended. It was suspended last June. On a like, this had over ten thousand subscribers, and this is what I've been running into, like. Stuff like this, um, you know, I, I just, I can't get the account back. Um, I don't even think I can make another account. They won't even allow it. Um, it's, it's just that this was an old channel and, you know, and now it's gone. And this was one, this is the big one. I just sickened by YouTube because apparently, you know, it, it's, it doesn't care. They don't care how much work you put into this. Here's what, this is People Stand Up. As you can see, there's the People Stand Up. Everybody knows that channel's up there. But here, what happens? When I try to go into that channel, here's what happens. Uh, if I go into YouTube, there's, there's all the videos. There they are. There's everybody. There's over 89 videos there. I click on YouTube. Look what happens. If I sign into my channel, it comes up and says that. It says you have been redirected this page. I can't get access to nobody. It's been suspended. The channel's up there. You all can see it. It's up there. This is crazy. And I say to you people that are that are, are in the truth movement or or you're, or you're trying to do honest work and you're, you're, you're trying to get the truth out, I am telling you, be back up your work. Do not put your soul and your heart and your minds in YouTube. They don't care. They really don't. It's run by corporations. You know, it's not just me. I'm here with my family, my friends, my community. And yet this is this is not where I want to be. I don't I'm just saying to others out there, if you're making videos and stuff and let's it's become like a police state. YouTube is like if you put up a video and somebody doesn't like it, it's so like when we first came on here, there were so many people with visions. There were visionaries, great visionaries. These people, many, many, many of them. I could name a whole bunch of people that I met on here. They're awesome, awesome people that did a lot for humanity to move it forward. And YouTube was like the people's TV, and you could see it. Corporations got control of it. It isn't the people's anymore. And I'm going to say one thing to all these people out there, people like Linda, people like uh, True Ray, keeping them straight. You know, um, 
my friend Greg, all these people, I, I say to you, like, I went out on the internet. We went out on the internet. We went out as the people stand up and we put up a, like this website. The public trust has been betrayed. Day, it wasn't just me. It was a team effort. I came on as a team of people. I didn't come on as one person. I didn't get anything from YouTube. What I got, I met some nice people. I got a lot of truth. I took the truth and went inside myself. Because remember, our eyes, as soon as we're born from our mothers, we open up our eyes and what do we do? We look outward. And when we look outward, we stop looking inward. And the world keeps telling us, don't look out. Go do a new course. Make this. Do that. Go here. And when you do that, what happens? You end up basically losing your spiritual fulfillment. How many videos have we made about the truth? How many things have we done in the truth movement? How many things have we done for the Occupy? How many things have we done for the 911? I've been here when all this happened. And to see, this is what YouTube's turned into. For anybody that's standing up for anything, I mean, you, it says it all in the name. People stand up. But this time, they fooled everybody. They made it look like the channel is still out there and nothing's wrong, but it isn't. This channel, as I showed you, it's totally suspended and I can't get access to it. I could write Google's Plus, but I can't use YouTube. And that's happened to every. I just look at it like, guys, I mean, we're talking people stand up, 10,000 plus subscribers. Facebook stand up, 6,000, 6,500 subscribers. Um, Martok, um, 7,000 subscribers. That had over um, 9 million views. All together with my friends, I think we lost something in the vicinity of oh, 22 channels. It's just it, YouTube becoming like a police state. I mean, it's like it's, it's becoming like Facebook. Let's face it. It was never like this. You could put a video up, and if somebody didn't like your opinion, or it was freedom of speech, it was called. And now it's it's called uh, like we said on our website. The public trust has been betrayed. And and no matter where we go or what we do, you find it everywhere. It's public trust, public trust. That's what YouTube's all about. Public trust. And anybody who wants to come see our letter, this is our letter. You know, I just say to people, you're on here for a legit cause, and you're trying to get help, don't come to YouTube. This is not the place to come. It's not cool. They, they just want to rip you down. They just want to tear you up. And I say to you people out there, if, you, if you're listening to this video, I'm going to put a remix on it if I can. And if you can remix it, the best way to get a video out on YouTube is put it on remix. If you're trying to do it for the truth movement, don't sell your stuff because I want you to know this. When you sell your videos, here's what happens. People that want to take your video or use it, they can't because it's a code in it and it stops people from taking down your videos. Plus, if you want to, if you, I'm talking about people that are trying to do it for the greater good. If you're here to make money, I don't want to hear my speech. But if you're here to do what's greater good, put your videos on remix. It's a billion people on YouTube. And you can see how there's problems. Like, look at these videos. One, look, that's why they're that's why they're mad at me because they did so good. It's nothing to do with with somebody got mad and then took the, took it out at us. And it's like this ain't right. This has been going on now. I, I'm to the point where what's the sense to put up anything controversial or say anything about anybody? They will take you down. People, lying, look around you. Anybody that stood up for anything on YouTube is gone. You know, that's sad that they're tearing us down one by one by one. I'm, you know, you talk about we stood here for something. We all came here for something. We stood for the planet. I mean, you think that the government or, or these people, the corporations are going to give you or me the access to help our people? No, they want to keep us enslaved. At least I got the truth. And I if I, I don't do anything else on the Internet. I got the truth. You lose all your work. You lose, you know, almost close to, I don't know, around 40,000 subscribers and, and a hell of a network we built for the greater good. Not for, we didn't build this for uh, for show or protest. We built it for the greater good to give people ideas how to fight back, how to stand up against tyranny. YouTube doesn't care about any of this stuff, folks. And I, I know that and you know that. And I'm just telling my friends, I love you all. If anybody gets this video, subscribe to me. That's the only way I can make contact with you if you stay on my subscribers list i know your videos and they're up there and i can watch this is hard this will take years to rebuild and i'm not doing it on youtube i have given all my creativity to this place and it's enough they get no more and i say to all the rest of you i i'm going back myself to my spiritual wholeness because that's where it's at this ain't it i hope someday that the people stand up can become more and and we can have a people stand up website for youtube people that want to stand up for the greater good and not have your work knocked over because if you don't build a website Website, you can't and if you don't pay for it yourself on the internet you're not going to be able to put nothing out because they are taking access every my channels uh, people stand up CA I put that out on uh, modernization I made seven hundred and eighty two dollars in one month that was over six years of work and they took it down right after that so you see what happens you take the money don't take the money folks it ain't good I say to all my friends you're better my friends go to your spiritual wholeness we did some real good work on the internet don't let that be forgotten but
it's over. The party is over, folks. It, it, it's for me. It is anyway. I don't know, but I'm not. I cannot go on this thing knowing that I'm somebody's little uh, or hamster going on a wheel over and over, doing the same things over and over and over. And that's what they want us to do. You don't. If you can't put up the news, put down the groundhog news. They 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 annihilated the whole channel. So. But other than that, I, I'm going to wait and see what happens, and I'll get back to you if I get any results, and I can, maybe I'll get this channel back. I don't know, but I'm going to fight one hell of a fight to try to. I came on here with friends, and I, I came on with a lot of channels. Not one channel, lots of channels, and they're gone. They're all gone. It's like they travel. I just say to my friends, I love you all, and God bless you all, but I can't go on like this. This is crazy. You can't work like this. We're trying to do things for the greater good, and you got people out there just waiting to take you down. Like this says... Obama versus that. Should I have put CTV news on it so they seen it? It was it was the news. There's no more. There's the news for CTV and the news for CBC. And how many people get trashed for the news? But I say to all my friends, you know, come back, uh, you know, subscribe to me, uh, remix my video, put it up, tell people, tell people what's going on YouTube. If we keep putting it all over the place, that's the thing. If we stay, if you stay in your own channels, they got you because that means they can control you. But if you put your videos on remix, those guys, these guys put up, those people that put up their v videos on remix, that's how you get your message out. YouTube ain't what it used to be. It's gone. It's changed. It's over. The experience for me is over. The people's movement is over. And I feel bad because that's what that's what made YouTube. It wasn't those cutie booty videos. Though everybody's got those. But how many people had the real news for the greater good? We didn't come here to hurt people or make people be bad people. We we were good people. And and YouTube doesn't seem to want good people. It wants just cutesy stuff, cats and 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 funny things. As you can see, what look around you. It's changing all over the place. Maybe you can't notice it because you've been here a long time, but you get knocked out like I have and you start noticing. It. Man, you come back in that new. It ain't the same as it was. It is change, change, change. And it's not the only place in town. I mean, there's lots of other video places. There's Do or Die, Daily Motion, there's Vimy. It's another good place. Um YouTube is it was a great place why it worked but for now it's just wow it's not here for us youtube itself no but i love the people and that's probably what keeps most of us coming back if i were you i'd start cutting and pasting and i'd start loading and i'd start transferring and back up everything you do because you can't you can't rely on this place anymore it's become really bad anyway i love you all i love my friends on youtube i made some awesome friends on here and some of you are awesome awesome people that you're from all over the world and that's what i like about it there's no spiritual host in this here it's all about you know giving your energy to this place for what to get burned down like this it ain't right these are the videos uh, i'm fighting this claim um this person is wrong um if we allow them to take our news uh, we might as well all get off of YouTube because, you know, it's over. I mean, this is shareware. And, and it's like, you know, th this is what I'm doing. I'm doing a countersuit right now. And uh, I may not, I may lose my channel. I may go to court, but I got to fight it. I mean, I've got to fill the information and uh, fill this out and send it off. And this will be my second counter. I'm just showing you what is going on in YouTube. I mean, this YouTube, I don't even think you, anybody in YouTube is even home. This is just robots. And this guy just happened to didn't like it that I put up a video of the news and it got a lot of uh, views and, and it seemed to upset him very, very much. So I can't, uh, I can't, uh, I just got to go and fill out the paperwork and I, I'm not backing down. This is the news and if I, I got to make a stand here. How many of you know about the news? But news is shareware and the news is free for all. And if we, if we can't allow to put the news up, then we might as well just stop. And it's a presidential and, and a funny or die. It's news and the CBC put it up and I copied the news. Anyone else of you copied news? Have you ever had it taken down because of the fact you it was news and somebody didn't, you know, you didn't like it? Um, that's what this is about. Somebody doesn't like it that I put up the news. I mean, this is just seeing what they're just showing you what is going on in YouTube. I mean, this YouTube, I don't even think you, anybody in YouTube is even home. This is just robots. And this guy just happened to didn't like it that I put up a video of the news and it got a lot of uh, views and, and it seemed to upset him very, very much. So I can't, uh, I can't, uh, I just got to go and fill out the paperwork and I, I'm not backing down. This is the news and if I, I got to make a stand here. Um, that's what this is about. Somebody doesn't like it that I put up the news. So other than that, um, I'll let you know how I make out. Take care. Bye.